I guess the uh, be sitting. I don't know. I, I love colors. to be your moment this supposed to be your moment this supposed to be your moment what good is being the one when you the only one that knows it hey man it's the iso guy sensei the greatest 2k player in existence and look it has finally happened mike wayne has returned to twitter and he's made a lot of tweets man so i'm finna break this down give y'all the real information that you should be expecting in nba 2k 22 man i easily got the best breakdown out of, out of all these 2k news channels man my my experience is bar none my buddy you know I, I i really be predicting the future and i really know how to fix 2k but anywho man before we get into this video make sure y'all subscribe if you're new help me hit 300k do me a favor and hit that like button and turn on them post notice, man. But look, let's get into it, man. So first tweet Michelle Wang makes. He says, new seasonal animation content drops are for my players only, not NBA players. The goal is to keep the game fresh all year long and encourage players to use signature moves that they otherwise may not have. Don't worry, there will still be a ton of variety to choose from at launch. So what this basically means is, so there was an interview yesterday that I covered in my last video. Y'all be sure to go peep that. He touched on this stuff about there being season for animations, right? So he's just saying this with the my players and the NBA, all that. You know, honestly, I don't think with the animations, there it's it's gonna be some good thing to be honest. Uh, 2K usually don't get shit right, especially when it comes to like. I don't know something like as in depth as this i think we're going to be robbed of animations and um i think this is just i think this is a way to put the curry slide at the end i i ain't gonna hold you man i think he's still trying to to be honest about this man i don't really see like they haven't talked about dribbling is just so different right like it's just mesmerizing and like it's just really in depth and just retouched so it's like for them to introduce this it seems like more of a restriction than a uh, more plethora and you're just getting helly animations that will be game changing down the year i don't know that's just my take y'all let me know how y'all feel about it so gameplay is supposed to be coming soon man you know we gonna see man it's getting close my boy Hey, drop the date down below of when you think we're going to see gameplay. <laughs> so Jaggy responds to Mike Wang and says, Will it just be locking existing animations behind this season's concept? Uh, that's a, you a smart guy, my dad! Michelle Wang says, Some of the content is from previous 2Ks. Ooh, you, you know how we feel about them previous 2Ks, them dribble moves. Like the curry slide, but most will be new. So... He's saying we're not going to have the curry slide off rip. This basically confirms it. My nigga, Michelle Wang really took it out the game. Let's read it again. Some of the content is from previous 2Ks, like the curry slide. And later on, I'm going to show a tweet where he, where he's basically, you know, where it's more information about the curry slide. So make sure y'all watch this full video, man. Is he basically saying he don't want to put it in the game? I ain't gonna hold you, man. So it's looking like we're gonna have to do it out the curry slide. Y'all let me know down below if y'all are happy or excited about that. So iMag Xbox says, Will you be able to purchase them during the duration of that season? Michelle Wang responds saying, some content will be season exclusive, but the actual on-court gameplay sigs, shots, and moves will stay in the game once they've dropped. Young T.O. says, Mike, if I get a good-ass jump shot and you take it away from me in a new season, I won't be happy. Michelle Wang says, shots won't be taken away, only added. 
Do y'all think they're gonna release some crazy shot, bro? Th this really has a lot of potential for like content, bro. Like if they release like crazy looking shots, um, shots with higher green windows, super fast shots, super high arcing shots. You know, if they, they really do something like that, you know, um, it could really be some good content, you know? Uh, I think that's dope. You know, something for YouTubers to make, something for y'all to enjoy, experiment with. I think that's cool, man. <sighs> y'all let me know how y'all feel about it. Y'all be sure to follow me on Twitch, Lord Baby Hulk, my boy. Follow me on Facebook too, Lord Baby Hulk, my boy. I'll be streaming on. Now, Backhand says, How has shooting changed exactly this year? Michelle Wang says, Hard to explain in a tweet. Man, I. Red flag! Leaked! Then he says, Main change is a much larger weighting toward the coverage. Aiming is gone. Leaked! That's a W. Y'all let me know if y'all think. Aiming gone is, is a W. I think it's a W. Stupid bum old heads. You want that shit? You're fucking ass. You want it to be easy for a reason. We know your type, my nigga. We know your type. Then he says, I explain more in the upcoming courtside report in a couple weeks. Nigga, the game come out in a couple weeks. Shooting is more predictable this year. <laughs> what, what did I tell y'all, man? Skill gap is predictability. When you can predict if you do this and they do that, what's going to happen? That's when you get a skill gap in anything in life. Always remember that. When shit is random ability, my nigga. <laughs> I don't even think that's a word. That's when shit is just, you know, RNG. Like, you don't really know. Like, it's like, it could go either way. Shit dumb. But then he says, I'm pretty confident the community will like it. We gonna see. Okay, so Cash Money tweets a clip or no, a screenshot of a nigga grinning in a nigga's faces. Pew, pew, pew. Big, tall looking niggas, right? My team. And he says, it's gone. He confirms, yes. Okay. That's a W, my boy. And let me know how y'all feel about Steady Shooter being gone. Can we dribble after a step back using square again? Oh my God, Ace. That is a amazing tweet, bro. Like dead ass. I used to love doing this in, I don't remember if it was in 14, it probably was, cause I had all the dribble animations, but nobody knew bro. But I used to love doing this in 16 and 17 and 18 and uh, 19 and I think they took it out in 20 or maybe it was in, I don't remember. But man, that was amazing thing. It really needs to come back bro. But he says no. But you can if you trigger the shot with the pro stick. That shit is ass. Um, that that shit is ass. Y'all need to go to this tweet. Make sure you follow me on Twitter, Z Swan TZ, baby. I'ma respond to all these tweets. Support me, you know. Follow me. I want to see thousands of followers, my boy. This vid's gonna get thousands of views. And I want y'all to support my tweet and go directly at this tweet and tell them you want the dribble after the step back square whatever the fuck is called in the game bro it's an amazing feature it, it's an amazing feature for fun level and just a fluidity level so t-bone says will animation six be limited per possession for example will we see power forwards and centers able to use curry slide and other animations if their playmaking is high or will certain animations be locked to certain positions Michelle Wang says, we're gating more animation based on size and ability this year. Hmm. So in the vid that I did yesterday, Michelle Wang said he thinks a lot of people are going to make midget point guards in NBA 2K22 in very big centers. So he's leaking the meta, my nigga. You know, but he said under six feet. So maybe if he don't have some animations or like a speed glitch, which he kind of leaks in like saying that, you know, higher speeds, a super fast speed boost. If they're not get if they get a speed glitch, then of course people are going to go there. But if it's just like, oh, you get to unlock 99 speed, but with a bigger point guard, you get to unlock 95, bro, the bigger your player model you're you're faster than the littler guards they need to fix that but yeah like big ass centers could be faster than someone with 
um, 90 speed and they have like 80 or 70, they could be just as fast or faster because their player model is bigger. And it's something they really need to fix. It's always been like that in 2K. I've been I've been saying that shit since before these little uh these little tested niggas uh the fucking 2K lab and the uh 2K toots or whatever. I've been saying this since like 14, bro. I've been like, bro, like these big ass niggas is catching up to me and my speed way higher. Like, I, bro, I've been going on rants, nigga. <laughs> Let's see if they can finally fix it on next gen. <laughs> But, um, Stay Dangerous says, man, nigga, you know you ain't dangerous, nigga. Stop the cap. But he says, what's more important is us using the controller. Will the muscle memory of dribbling be the same, or will I have to learn how to dribble again? Very good question. Keep at it, my nigga. Michelle Wang says, dribbling is probably a lot closer to 20 than 21 control-wise. Holding the pro stick always shoots like 20. But there are new moves and combos you're going to want to learn. We're going to see new moves and combos. We're going to see. But look, Michelle Wayne, um, you're a fucking idiot, bro. You're stupid as shit. You're stupid gameplay dev. And whoever else is under your team, bro. 20 was not a love dribbling 2K. Okay? Hopefully there's not a dribble glitch. Um, I don't get... If you're going to make a dribbling system close to a certain game that was in the past, why not make it the beloved dribbling games? People loved 15 dribbling, besides the fucking crossover 16 and 18 spam and shit like that. It was amazing, fluid, quick, fast. Same with 16, same with 17. Y'all could chill with the, like, the momentum spams and shit, I get it. And people love 19 dribbling. And people love 18 dribbling. Besides, like, the walking size up shit. I hated that shit, bro. But, and just keep the speed boost fast. Bro, and you will please a lot of people, bro. Why are you making it close to 20? Like, like I was a better dribbler in 20 than 21. But, I mean, like, I don't know, like. It's like these devs are stupid like it's like they're trying to create something in their image instead of what their consumers want you know i don't know what be wrong with these niggas the the prestige is getting to their head go on this tweet go crazy my nigga change the future so jojo says well you still need a high three point to shoot because it was hard to shoot with an 83 point that was in the beginning of the year now if you guys are playing 2k21 bro he definitely buffs shooting because i am greening all the time on my slasher that has an 81.3 um they definitely buff shooting people think they're like so amazing now people making videos and shooting with a 43 point it wasn't like that for like first half of the year man i'm trying to tell you but michelle wing says you don't have to be as high as last year to be a perimeter shooting threat this is ass and it's good at the same time um this is ass because this means 30 badge lockdowns with 99 speed max wingspan um they're gonna be gods paint beasts are gonna be gods and they're gonna be able to green at the same time so they're gonna be amazing in the paint <laughs> for my presumptions unless they get it right this year they're gonna be amazing with shooting. You'll be able to green if you're not a bot. And they're gonna have enough playmaking, most likely. Probably enough playmaking to be like a, a secondary guard. And they're gonna have maxed defensive badges. Like shit's shit's broken. Um they need to fix that shit. Uh they kind of fixed it a little bit with this this year. But it's looking like it's probably going to make a comeback. Um, I do believe Slash and Playmaker's shit should be able to shoot. But, um, yeah, bro, like, when it hits, like, the lower end or, like, the mid end, them niggas should not be able to shoot, bro. Or just have all-around builds like, like uh, Next Gen. I love that shit. You know, all around superstars. That that's the best build system since it, 16, man. Most fair.
JWP says, hey, Mike, is real player percentage still in the game? It shouldn't be in the game, but um, that helps with my career. Hopefully it's not OP online. And um, Zens, we talking about Zens. Neb says, I would pay $1,000 to know if you remove vibration from 22 or not. Hey, hit my PayPal, nigga. Swante910 at aim.com. Hit my PayPal. Give me thousands. Someone, y'all go tell Swan. Give, them, give, them, give me the thousands. Y'all niggas could give me something too. Give me 10% of your check, my boy. But he wants to know for thousands of dollars if he removed vibration from 22 or not. Can't have Zen made bozos like how 21 made for 90% of the year, bro. Right? Stupid ass nigga. He says the vibration shot cue is gone. Beautiful. I love it. It's ass at the same time, but I love it at the same time because I used to really use that vibration for shooting, man. I use vibration in every game I play. Y'all let me know down know down below if you use vibra vibration when you game um, with other games, not just 2K. Joe Ross, the fifth, I believe that is, or the fourth. He says, will both next and current gen console receive the new animations and SIGs? Or will one get some exclusive to its generation? Michelle Wang says the plan is to release the same SIG animations on both gens. Damn. No differential. Uh, y'all let me know how y'all feel about that. Brody or Browdy says how different is current from next gen? Michelle Wang says current and next gen are much more similar on court this year compared to last year. Um, y'all let me know how y'all feel about that, man. I think next gen should be way better, but we're we're gonna test this out and we we really gonna see. Drive Paint says, does no shot meter still give you a boost to your shot percentage in 2K22? And he says, yes. This is Grimson news. It should be out the game. Uh, it makes shooting too easy, bro. Um, ever since this was added in, uh, it, it seemed like it would be a good a good idea, but now shooting is just too easy, bro. You know, um, there's no point of the cool looking meters. And um, yeah, like there's no point of meters anymore because of this. Uh, if people want to not use it, not use a meter, um, then yeah. But shooting is just so easy now um, because of this. And I don't think shooting should get all these badges and boost without you know jump shot boost all this shit make it the game way too easy bro y'all let me know how y'all feel about it. and here is what i was talking about with the curry slide twitch cam says curry slide is seasonal content laughing my ass off the whole 2k guard community will be in shambles maybe i shouldn't release it at all you see he's testing i bet you he's reading these comments Look, look, look at Chalk, look at Chalk. Chalk don't want that curry slide in the game. He don't want that curry slide in the game. He feel it at risk. Hey, I don't really complain about the curry slide. Oh, Clake flaming it. Let me like this nigga on my burner. He flayed, speaking of crying, remember when you cried because you zen? <laughs> Chalk, you a bitch. Look, did, look, let me, let, me, let me talk about that real quick, bro. The whole fact that he wasn't flaming them them DF niggas and just roasting the fuck out of them, like, makes him guilty, bro. Like, dead ass. Like, nigga breaks down crying like a little bitch. Like, that, 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 that shit is weird, bro. Come on, Chuck. Like, come on, man. We grown men out here, dog. Like, I know you saying all that reputation, but nigga flame them niggas. You laugh. Like, bro, if someone accuses me of shit... I'ma be laughing, bro. Like, yeah, <laughs> you're upset it, ha! <laughs> like, nigga, shut your, nigga, you flame these niggas. Like, shut your, it ain't no irrefutable proof, bro. <laughs> no, you be like, you laugh at these niggas, like, like that, that, that's why. Cause like, when someone gets caught cheating, they break down crying, all this shit, all this shit, you know, but. You know, if you be in fault, you just laugh. You make jokes of these niggas. Like, that'll be like, that. that's how I've always viewed it. When people said I was cheating in old 2Ks, 
and shit, like, before, even when anyone even knew this Zen shit, like, niggas called me cheaters, fucking all types of shit, or in, like, other games, like, I would just, I'd be dying laughing, like, it would be a hilarious clip, like, an old head, a kid, I know now, since people are, like, actually cheating, before all this PC gaming existed, bro, like, it was just hilarious, like, I'm not, like, niggas is trying to ruin my reputation, you know, I don't know. Like, when niggas call me, like, an exploiter and all this shit, like, I'm laughing, bro. I don't know. Y'all let me know. Mike Wayne confirms new jump shot landings. That's cool. So, Mike Wayne said overalls won't drop this year, and he clarified early today. To clarify, you won't lose overall next gen as we have different systems in place there. Overalls can still fluctuate in current gen. Damn, I know some of y'all niggas is mad. But um, if you unlock animations at 99, do you lose them? Blah, 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 blah. He really didn't answer this. We got to uh, see if for last gen, if you lose the animations. But um, I don't know how f the, the 99 overall system, it needs to... It needs to be revamped completely, bro. Like, I think it's cool that people, like, if they're, like, actually losing, like, they lose their overall and shit. But, like, if you just didn't perform a certain way and you still got a certain amount of points and all this shit, like, you still losing your overall. You have an amazing game dropping 72 points, still lose. Overall, I think that shit is ass. It got to be revamped, but I don't know, man. Y'all let me know how y'all feel about this. And we won't lose 99 this year for um, next gen. I think it's going to be like Road to 99 and uh, 19, I believe it was. That's what it's looking like. Will there be a new shot meter in 2K22? Yes, there's a new shot meter. Man. Hey, man, if you made it this far, make sure you like the video. Turn on post notice. Make sure you subscribe. If you are new, help me hit 300K. And yeah. I'm uploading daily. Make sure y'all here tomorrow. Make sure y'all go check out my other videos. They are hilarious, especially my gameplay ones. But hey, hey, here we go again. Yeah. Here we go again. People talking this, but when this hit the fan, everything I'm at made me. Now break it down. Yo, off the top of the dome, dome.